So, you know, the hangover game told me I got to start from white boy. So, you know, we doing Tom McDonald and we started from white boy. So, you know, we all drop suggestions. Wolf always listen, man. But, you know, so far I reacted to two Tom McDonald songs and that man is a beast. And you can tell he speak his mind. He's straightforward. That's dope. A lot of rappers don't do it nowadays. So we about to hop right on into this. I cannot feel guilty for that I didn't do But I can understand the reasons why you think that I should Yeah, I'm white, but I never put your neck in no noose And I never burnt a cross or hit my face with a hood You can't just label me racist Cause I'm related to people who did some terrible Way back before I was alive My parents brought me up to treat everyone as an equal I refuse to feel ashamed cause of my pretty blue eyes And not white supremacist Anyone who Yo, he started off, he started off great. Like, this is why I like him. Like, he's straightforward on how he feel, regardless of however somebody want to take it. He's straightforward. You know where he stands. You feel me? There's no being around a bush. When he's speaking in this type of way, there's no, like, double entendre. Like, he mean what he says. Like, he take it literally. Like, I mean, he he's he speaking facts, though. Um, For, for a lot of people of his skin color, like, their, their grandparents and parents like brought them up to treat everybody as equal. Don't don't see race as as a, a separation, as, as a difference. You treat everybody as, as a whole. We're all human beings. We all bleed. So his his people brought him up that way. So that's the way how he viewed things. We can't like other people can't look at him and just because his skin color and think that he dealt with racism or anything of that sort, prejudice. Like it doesn't have to be that way. We're going back though. He started. He started off right. Hi, uh. Before I was alive, my parents brought me up to treat everyone as an equal. I refuse to feel ashamed because of my pretty blue eyes. And not white supremacist. Anyone who labels me as that because of my family genetics. The hatred for Caucasians is so pathetic. Go be proud that you're black, but don't hate me for some credit. I'm not the white devil, neo Nazi cop trying to pull the trigger. You can call me what you want, but I'd still never say the white race as a whole. <laughs> he could call me what you want, but I'll, st I'll still never say nigga. Uh, I, I see, I see this, I see this is dope. This is dope. I like his perspective on this, really dope. Um, and like I always say, he he coming straight forward, and well, what he's saying, it doesn't relate to the masses, but what he's saying, it relates to a, a good amount of white people that feel this way, and they have a right to feel this way that that certain amount, but there's a lot that's still racist. So he's speaking from his part. So, you know, we all can't quit them all together, but we, we see what he's talking about. Because of my family genetics, the hatred for Caucasians is so pathetic. Go be proud that you're black, but don't hate me for some credit. I'm not the white devil, neo-Nazi cop trying to pull the trigger. You can call me what you want, but I'd still never say. The white race as a whole ain't the enemy. There's racist white people, but we're far from that collectively. White boy, don't say that. White boy, oh, you so bad. White boy, you you were black, white boy, dear white boy. on some cognac sitting next to me i don't assume that every black's favorite drink is hennessy i don't dislike tanisha because her first name isn't stephanie not only is that wrong it's a waste of energy <laughs> that's facts <laughs> he said i don't hate tanisha or i don't this I, I don't dislike tanisha because her name isn't stephanie her first name isn't stephanie oh man he said that he don't he don't say every black person favorite drink is Hennessy. Hey, I mean, you feel me? I see where he getting at though. You don't just, cause they have stereotypes. You just don't group a whole race in that stereotype. I see, I see what you mean, bro. But like I said, speak his mind. You gotta respect that. Tanisha, cause her first name isn't Stephanie. Not only is that wrong, it's a waste of energy. Ivory or ebony, 45 or 17. We all bleed the same, Martin Luther King or Kennedy. They're angry, I'm reciting the facts. He's white and he raps. He stole the culture right from the facts. Okay, he's fire, but we lit the flame. He 
sniffing and gas. So this corny little honky man, the whitey is whack. You letting history perpetuate the hate you within. And then you paint me with the brush you painted slave owners with. Yeah. White boy, don't say that. White boy, oh you so bad. White boy, you wish you were black. White boy, be a white boy. Sister, an auntie, and uncle, and a grandma that I picture when you're openly hating. And God willing, one day I'll have a kid of my own. I refuse to let you blindly hate my wife or my baby, so go ahead and hate the races. I pray for their extinction. If you want to hate the white people, just make the distinction between the ones who want the best for everyone, regardless, and the ones who built the system just to smother you with hardships. Mmm, bars. But I said, there's this whole separation. Deal, dealing with um power and a whole separation dealing with status as well. So you said don't don't group us all in. If you gonna hate hate the ones that's really doing all this stuff, hate the ones that really been out there in the fields being slave owners or grandparents or grand grand grandparents or whatever. He said hate those. Hey he. He dropping bars. He dropping bars. You gotta respect it for real. We're going back a little bit. Do want the best for everyone, regardless, and the ones who built the system just to smother you with hardship. Stop before you say it. I know what you've been thinking. How's a straight white male in 2018? You're making me the villain by demonizing my race for things I didn't do and decisions I didn't make. No one that I call a friend has ever owned a slave, and neither did our dads or our dads' dads. For sakes acknowledging atrocities were wrongly committed. Is all that I can offer when I'm wrongly convicted. I would never hate a man for what God gave him in pigments, and I would never plot against him just because he is different. I would never judge a human for the cards he was given or call him lesser than myself because of the race that he's mixed with. Mm. White people that you hate aren't your neighbors or lawyers. They're the Rockefellers, Rothschilds, Bushes, and Royals. They're the, the Rockefellers and Rothschilds. Hey, my dog dropping some knowledge out there for real, for real. Okay. The cards he was given or call him lesser than myself Cause of the race that he's mixed with White people that you hate aren't your neighbors or lawyers They're the Rockefellers, Rothschilds, Bushes and Royals They're the people who monopolized the water and oil And injected your communities with drugs that they spoiled Got no patience for Nazis, I think they're better off dead Now fighting hatred with hatred making the hate more intense I don't want nothing to do with either side of the fence So don't blindly attack me for wearing braids on my head Hate the people who believe you put yourselves in the ghetto Hate the ones who teach their children you ain't Cause they said so Hate the ones who think you're all the same and judge you profusely Cause the way that you're portrayed on our news and in movies Being white and being racist aren't the same man I promise No it's hard to tell the difference if I'm just being honest I deserve the chance to show you I'm not part of the problem And you owe it to yourselves We got so much in common White boy, don't say that White boy, oh you so bad White boy, you Wish you were black, white boy, be a white boy. Say that white boy, oh you so bad, white boy, you wish you were black, white boy, dear white boy. Yo, this was dope. This is dope, but I always say, man, I always come through with his truth, and you know where he stands, and that's what's up. He he spoke he spoke his truth. This is how he feel, regardless if you like it or not. He still came with interesting um an interesting perspective. And you could look at it. So nah, man, he did his thing on this track for real. I love artists like this that open up and give you different ways of thinking. But that's it for the reaction. Y'all know what to do. Smash that like button, subscribe, share. Wolf out. Wait, wait, wait. Don't leave yet. Stop. Stop. Before y'all guys leave, subscribe to the channel, ring the notification bell, and please send me suggestions on what I should react to, anything of that sort, so I can keep entertaining you guys and keep bringing out new content. Also, remember, it's always peace, love, and positivity. All the time, 2020 and on. Wolf out.